Hey guys, it's Sarah here. I am going to do a quick tutorial for you for a bedroom lamp that's very cheap and easy. And I've actually had it hanging in the corner of my room lately, in case you haven't seen it. I've been waiting to find the right lights to get for it. Now that it's Christmas, there's a vast selection of lights out there. So I finally picked up some white lights that are super cheap and in stock at my store. So I'm going to do that. And if you're curious on how I did this and might be interested in doing it yourself, keep watching. Hey guys, so this is my bird cage that I actually got for half off at Hobby Lobby, so it was a really good deal. I think it might have been like $15, something along those lines, but it was super cheap. And then I picked up these lights at my local Lowe's in the um, patio furniture decor area. Um, one thing I don't like, and I looked for white lights, is I couldn't find white lights. So now that it's Christmas, I picked a pack up. And I think this might have been along, this was $5, $4.99, so super cheap. So let's go ahead and get started, and I will show you how to do this. It's super easy, just a little bit time consuming. Alright, so now that I got the lights off, I am going to string the new ones through, and I got 100 clear mini lights. And I like the mini lights because they're just a little bit smaller, and it's up to, let's see, lighted length is 24.7 feet long. So I think that should be about good. I can't remember what this one was, but I think it was about the same. So, Ooh, they look very nice. I'm excited. Alright, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch out the lights and make them not so kinky. Alright, so you are going to want to lead through using the nom prong side, and so, because this one's going to be harder to weave through, but the most important part is you need to make sure you have a lot left out for when you hang it in, that's dangling down when you plug it in. So you want to start with this and make sure that you have the length you want for where it's going to reach and where the plug will be. And this is kind of hard to get through. Got it. Okay. So, you pull through the desired amount of length. Alright, that seems like a good length to start out with. I put a little bit extra just kind of sitting in the bottom just in case I do need extra length I can pull it through so that's just an important tip then we are going to start weaving it through so we take this top part and we start weaving it through the top of the birdcage so that we can hang them through Now you want to make sure that you space it out a little bit on the top so that you can start draping it. So we have this dangly portion here, which is great. So now we want to kind of go one, two, three, four over. I'm going to do and do the next length. So now I've run it through the top and I have this little piece right here and now I want to get my mount that I want to have dangling. That looks pretty good. Now I'm going to go like this, maybe a little bit longer, like that and I'm going to remember right here is where I'm going to stop when I have it up here. So I'm going to string it through to this point. So now I am about at that point, so I'm going to push it out, just make sure it's the length I want it, maybe a little bit higher up, so it dangles a little bit more. 
fan that, that is. That is perfect. Now I'm going to do it all over again, stringing it back through. I just want to kind of adjust the wires and how they're hanging inside. And just like that. And so you can see all of my wires. So now I'm going to plug this in and test it out. Alright, so this is my lights. I plugged them in and this is actually um, one of the lights broke. So make sure that you save the empty packet or the packet of extra light bulbs because if you lose one, the whole string goes out and that's really annoying. So I hope you like that tutorial. It's super easy and cheap, which is great. It's very shabby, chic, and cute. And I really like it. So I hope you did too. Yeah, so uh, rate, comment, and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. <laughs> Bye.